Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So first off, I hope you guys had a wonderful, wonderful Christmas and I hope you guys got everything that you had on your wish list. But if not, there's always next year, so. Anyways, um, I wanted to do a quick video on a repair situation I have going on with Louis Vuitton and um, ask your thoughts on it because I'm really torn as to what I need to do. And so um, let's just jump right into it. So um, they sent my bag back right before Christmas and so I was able to look over it through the weekend and I d I'm still kind of debating what I need to do and um, so this is my pochette Matisse um, I was looking over the bag one day and I realized that the glazing was a little wonky in one place and so I took it into Louis Vuitton and they immediately no questions asked they said they were going to reglaze the bag for me and that was about nine weeks ago um, I hadn't gotten the bag back until now, and when I looked at the bag, I had some things that were bothering me, and so I'm going to go over that with you and see what you guys think and what you think I should do. So, first off, they put it in beautiful Christmas packaging. They gave me this ginormous dust bag, and here she is, my beautiful Porsche Matisse, my favorite, favorite all-time bag. And I'll show you what happened. So I had brought this in because of this area right here. The glazing in this opening flap where it opens and closes was starting to peel a little bit. So I brought it in and they were really great. Um, it was before it was a year old and so they automatically said they were going to send me in for reglazing. So immediately when I got it back, I noticed that first off, the top handle was brand new and I had never asked for that. So it got me questioning what, what, what they had done. And I realized that they had actually replaced this whole back piece. And so this is an entirely new piece. So the zipper pocket is new and the top handle is new. They just reused my hardware and my front tab. So the first thing that bothers me about that is that these two now do not match at all. Now, I mean, I'm glad to have a new top handle, but I don't know, like that kind of bothers me, but let me just go over everything and then I'll ask your opinion later. So that does not match, as you can see. Number two is they replaced the whole back piece, which includes the zippered pocket. So now the date code inside, it starts with the DK, which is made in France. Whereas this body part, my original bag was made in the USA. So now the body is made in USA and the date code says made in France. And I don't know if that's going to be an issue if I ever decide to sell this bag, which I don't currently, so I don't know if that's a big issue or not, but that's what happened. So the final thing that really bothers me is this, and you can see it right away. The canvas is different. This is a lot more shinier, it's a lot more squishier, and this is a lot more matte and sturdy, which actually I prefer this canvas more, but the fact that these two do not match kind of bothers me. And as you can see, it's not because of me touching it. The inside also has the same shininess to the canvas that this part does. And so it's just the difference in canvas because this is a lot newer and this is a lot older. So um, another thing is the color. This one has more of a green undertone, whereas this one is a lot more red. So I don't know if that shows off well on camera, but yeah, you can see that there's a difference. So the last thing that I noticed, actually there's one more thing, is this stitch. I don't know if this was like this before they took it in, but I really doubt it because I think I would have seen it. There is this big hole where the stitch has popped. And it should not look like that. It should look like this, completely sewn all the way to the top. And it's not. So there's a little gap right there. So that's what happened to the bag. Um, honestly, I like the look of this part a lot better than the original, um, but the fact that it's different from the front, the body to the, to the flap, I don't know because, yeah, I don't know if that's something that's 
very noticeable. I mean, honestly, after Papa Luca the Third, but it still bothers me. So I need, I need to ask you guys, what do you guys think? Do you think I should take it back? I mean, I did um, contact the, the manager of my store um, and I told him that I am a little bit concerned. Um, the, the thing about that is, I mean, he's super nice and everything, and the reason why he's not immediately saying bring it in is because um, I had another repair done at the same time. It was my number four GM. Um, it's, it was very worn, um, and they replaced the straps, but ended up putting a hole in the canvas where the straps had been reattached. And on his um, word, he gave me a brand new bag, and it was and just plain, you know, just him being really, really nice about it. And so that's what he said. He said, I just gave you a brand new Neverfull and I don't know if I can do anything about this because he's not sure that um, that's something that corporate would accept. And so that's the reason why he's being a little bit reluctant as to do anything about this new repair. Um, I don't know if I should fight it out, if I should really push for it. Um, yeah, I'm really, really torn. And so I want to ask you guys what you think, if you think this is something you could live with or if it's something that I should, you know, kind of, kind of really, really push them to. And, you know, they just gave me a brand new bag, so I don't know. Yeah, I feel a little bit guilty doing that too. I don't know why, but it's just, yeah, it's, I kind of don't know what to do. So anyways, please let me know your thoughts on this. I would really, really love to get your advice. So let me know what you think and I will see you in my next one. Bye.